What's up, everybody? DIB Sports. I bet you already saw the video like a million times. You got uh, Steph Curry mocking LeBron James at a wedding. He's doing this, you know, the whole workout video that turned to a challenge. And uh, my man is having a good time at the wedding. But the one thing I think is crazy wasn't the Steph Curry thing. I think Curry has every right to make fun of LeBron James. Just like LeBron James made fun of Steph Curry in the Warriors last year. And was talking all that smack with three one cookies, but why is Kyrie Irving in the mix? That's what makes it the 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 worst thing. It's the it's not the mocking. It's the fact that he's there with the current champ. Now stars hang out with each other all the time uh, after off season, but it's really strange when the team or the players that just played the finals. Hang out the next day. That, that's or the next month or two. That is weird. It's like that's like Tom Brady hanging out with like uh, Matt Ryan the next day. That or in the summer they're not homies. Y'all just lost a championship. I don't think Matt Ryan wants to play with Tom. Hang out with Tom Brady after that point. So it's kind of weird to see that. Um, I know that they're all human. They're all people at the end of the day. But still, there's a certain boundary you, you, you even in the workforce that you just don't do um it's weird that Kyrie Irving is mocking LeBron James like that and laughing and having a good time and even though the, he requested a trade it's just it's a bad look um this is to me I think are either the generation coming up don't respect LeBron James and I think this is the end of LeBron James in my opinion is he going to play very well next year? Yes, he will. Is he the best player in the NBA? Probably. You know, he is pretty good. Um, but I think the respect factor and the fear factor of LeBron James coming down the lane is gone. Everybody's mocking his dude. Um, it's crazy. One finals loss changed everything. Like, it just changed everything about um, the whole the whole team with the Cavaliers. Because um, the Cavaliers were respectable. Now they're falling apart. One finals destroyed the whole team. Now, Kyrie Irving, maybe he had this thought in his mind for years. And just now he's like, you know what? We lost the finals. Been to the finals three times. This is my final. My, I, I, I don't really care about championships like that. I got my one ring. I'm ready to move on. And he's young. He's only 23 or 4 or 5. He, he don't care. He just wants to be a star again. And that's why he signed the contract originally was for a short contract. But this guy, um, LeBron James, he wants that legacy. But Kyrie Irving don't want that legacy. Kyrie Irving wants to do his own thing, would be his own man. That's why he traded for a trade. He asked for a trade. And um, the fact that he's at Steph Curry's and Harrison Barnes' uh, party wedding, whatever it was, it was, Harrison, it was Harrison Barnes' wedding, which is weird. Um... It really shows that he don't give a damn about LeBron James. And if I'm a, his teammate, pss, man, I'll be like, you know what? Deuces, forget you, dog. Um, man, nobody respect LeBron James these days, man. One After that finals, dog, everything fell apart. So that's my thoughts about that, man. I think Kyrie Irving uh, really crossed the line. He crossed the line, and... Um, That's hard to go back from. I don't. You can't be. I don't know if I could be friends with somebody like that. You know, who you once worked with. Now he's mocking you behind your back in front of social media. Woo, man, it's crazy. This NBA drama is better than the regular season. So what do you think? You think uh, Kyrie Irving is going taking this stuff too far? I think so, man. It's it's like I said. It's not Curry's fault. Curry's having a good time doing this whatever. But he could do that. He won a championship. But when your own boy from your team that lost the championship is out there celebrating with him, that's that's just that's some some Benedict Arnold type of stuff. Yeah, that's DIB Sports. Thanks for watching. Sub.